these particular scientists are totally honourable, they're world-class experts, their information is totally consistent with other information, we should trust them. It's a very serious accusation. First, they don't own all the data. They're trying to make it available so all other scientists can analyze it. But this data is actually owned by the meteorological offices around the world. Today, they're trying to get permission to release all the data. But independent of this particular well, I data... I don't, it, I don't agree. Independent of this particular I, data I think, set... I think, I think we must have Fred, an investigation. Fred, Fred, we must have a proper investigation and establish exactly what happened. Okay, I that's can't fair enough. accept the fact. All right. You, yeah, hang on a second, hang on. Professor Singer. It's a fair enough call to have an investigation to establish what happened, isn't I it? I agree completely. We should try an investigation of how is it illegally hacked into and then a complete, and a complete, and a complete disclosure of all the information right. so we can see was it appropriate analysis of the data or not. Secondly, the point is there are independent data sets in the United States, both in NASA and in NOAA, that show exactly the same trends okay. as this information.